It's less than a month for the race. It's officially October and it's exciting because I get to go to San Francisco, run the gate, see my friend. The sad part is my earbuds died, so I'm gonna have to run without music. For the month of September, I took a break from resistant training to concentrate on running. If I did have the energy to weight train, I focus on upper body workouts. Additionally, I started swimming on rest days to keep my body moving. After, I added a 5 to 10 minute session in the sauna and I feel like it helped with my soreness. I am having this apple cinnamon gel and I also added some salt in my water. I think that's a lot of salt, but <laughs> we'll see how it goes. You know what the flavor reminds me of? I was scared that I wouldn't like it. Yeah, the flavor reminds me of apple pie from McDonald's. I just finished running four miles for the short run. I just went to drop off my sister at school and I am coming to the gym to run about five miles. I didn't want to do it outdoors. Essentially, I took a little break because my knees were killing me. I think I was running improperly for the 10 miles and it was not good the days after. This week, I'm attempting to do two short runs and I don't know if I'll do the long run just because um, I'm worried that I'm gonna overdo it again. I am working on pacing myself better so that I don't like get too excited and start running faster in the beginning because I do think that affects me towards the end. I may purchase over pronation shoes because I've noticed that my foot placement when I'm running, I tend to not have a neutral position. I just need to make sure that it is over pronation and not the other way around. Today for my run, I'm going to be using this gel to energize me. Last time I had the lemon one for the 10 mile run and it did help. I just didn't really like the flavor, but at that point I didn't really care about the flavor. I just wanted to get through the run. So I don't know what's going on with this machine. It sent me to cool down. Apparently in this gym, the machine will send you to a cool down after a certain amount of time. Therefore, you need to specify the length, but it will only allow you 60 minutes. This only happened at this gym. I am excited about my outfit. I picked an outfit. I think I spent too much on it, but I'm not regretting it. I've been working hard, so I feel like it's worth it. Working hard both in running and in life. I ended up going for a shirt that is climate proof because my friend did bring up a good point that it might be windy. And I don't know if it's gonna rain, but I thought about getting a jacket, but I'm not gonna get it with the same brand. Which, by the way, my whole outfit is gonna be on cloud. So the top's on cloud, the pants are on cloud, or leggings, the shoes on cloud, and the socks will be on cloud. I feel like I like weight training better than running. So we'll see if I decide to sign up for a full marathon. Because I think, you know, I only live once, might as well experience it, but I don't know. It's just a lot. 11 miles on the treadmill completed. I do not feel accomplished though. I've been wearing my knee sleeves for the run. I did it for the whole run because I'm just worried about injuries. And... But I feel like they help me a lot and they work out. I'm hoping the day of the race I'll have more energy. But so far starting them has been a drag and ending them has been a drag. Ooh. I told myself that if I completed the 11 miles through, regardless of whether I was walking or running, jogging, just completed them, I would get some sushi. So I'm gonna go get a roll. So I ordered a dragon roll, yum yum. Be devouring it with garlic, spicy garlic, edamame, and beans. Mm. 